you know, right now I'm working on a lot of uh, marketing and pushing for the first album, Diamond in the Rough, and um, working on some music videos. It seems like there's so much I want to do. There's so much I want to do with the with the album. It's, it's crazy. But, um, yeah, I'm making moves right now. Um, uh, just hooked up with uh, some old management from back in the day, and um, we really, really are starting to get the ball rolling. So there's going to be a lot of shows coming up and stuff like that. So stay tuned. Everything will be, you know, posted and stuff on the on the website and uh, social networks. You'll hear it on the radio. So make sure you come out to see me. I'm from the Bronx, from the BX. You know what I'm saying? BX, stand up, Black Diamonds speaking for you you know what i'm saying um i've been a lot of places uh, seen a lot of things done a lot of things um that a lot of people probably wouldn't understand and then uh and a lot would you know um i'm just like everybody else trust me i'm just like everybody else but i, I have something to say i want to talk to you i want i want everybody to know who i am uh, you know what i'm saying at the same time send a message to the people um i grew up in the bronx i was uh upstate New York, Poughkeepsie, um, then uh, down south, down, uh, Dallas, Texas, D-Town. So I got some people down there in the music, you know, Monster Mafia, Oak Cliff Assassins, you know what I'm saying? Peace was good. Um, so yeah, I've been a, a little bit of everywhere and uh, I'm well-rounded because of it, you know what I'm saying? I wasn't uh, an R&B singer and decided to rap because it wasn't working. Um, I didn't just become a rapper, it's part of my life. I was born and raised in the Bronx, first of all, number one, that's the first point. Boom, that should be the answer, but you know, uh, there's more to me than that. So um, yeah, back in the day, uh, even to this day, my uncle, DJ Baby D, you know, grew up in the uh, in the projects over there off of Trinity Avenue. Uh, met Big Pun over there, you know, before he passed and stuff like that. And uh, Fat Joe. So they go to the same corner stores that I go to, you know what I'm saying? That's that's what it is. Um, my mother used to rap, but she used to rap like in the living room. My uncle used to come on with his DJ stuff to grandma's house. And my uncles and cousins and my mother would be in the, in the living room rapping and writing rhymes and oh, you know, getting in ciphers and stuff like that. And um, you know, it, it, it was part of me, it's, it's part of my upbringing, so I didn't just become a rapper. I've always wanted to express myself, and rapping is the way I express it. I love music, I love rapping. Um, what better way to get your message through to people or speak to people or express yourself than that? There is in no way, shape, or form that I believe that being a female rap artist is a boost, a positive um, in the game. Unfortunately, female rappers before me either had to be a clown to get in or a stripper, and that's how they have presented it for people like myself who's just coming in the game uh, or coming onto the scene, I should say. Um, and that's unfortunate. However, I do believe there is an audience, um, a crowd of supporters for real talented female rap artists, you know what I mean? I do believe that that is out there, and um, don't get me wrong, sexy is sexy, sexy is good, but sex is not all that you're about, hopefully, and that's not you know, all that I'm about, and I want to be uh, the one to prove that. Um, I don't think it's a hindrance being a female rap artist getting in the game. I just think that um, there's a little retardation <laughs> trying to get into the game as a female rap artist due to the way female rap artists prior got into the game. You know, um, I like to look good, I like to look sexy, no doubt, but at the same time, I'm not stripping so you can hear what I'm saying. My clothes is not talking, my mouth is. So, you know what I'm saying? That's what that's what pushes me, and um, that's that.
what's my message? Um, truth, realness, honesty, humbleness. You know, my message is, uh, is not necessarily a message at all. It's pretty much what it is. Um, I'm not trying to sugarcoat anything, you know. If it's street, it's street. It's going to be nasty. It's going to be grimy. It's going to be dirty. And those who are youngsters listening to my music, they're going to get to ask themselves that question like, dang, do I really want this? You know, I'm not going to glorify it and make it look sparkly or anything. You know what I mean? I want the truth to be told, the truth to be known. I'm not going to cover anything up. I'm not going to act like it's pretty. You know what I'm saying? So there's a lot of... Um, I like to have fun, so there's a lot of partying and stuff like that, a lot of good club tracks and stuff like that that I like to put out there. Um, I want to empower women, and empowering women doesn't necessarily mean putting the brother down, but it just means that I want them to know that we are strong, uh, we are a strong, you know, people as females, and I want to... Uh, that to be known. What can you expect from Black Diamonds? Well, I am working on a lot right now for this first album that is officially out. Um, got the marketing and distribution contract for the first album and right now I'm working basically on pushing that album. Um, you're going to see a lot of videos, a lot of um, live shows and um, you know, a lot of appearances and stuff like that. Um, not only that, I'm going to still be on what brought me here. I'm going to be on the little video clips and YouTube and stuff like that in the social network, still talking to my people because I ain't going nowhere, you know, right here. Yo, what's good? It's Black Diamonds, and I want to thank you for getting to know me, you know what I'm saying? And anything I say to you, I'm going to be truthful, I'm going to be honest, whether somebody like it or not. P people take offense to things that ain't got nothing to do with them all the time, but you know what? I don't have time for that. Um, I'm just uh, excited about getting to work right now, just excited about talking to my people, my supporters. Don't have fans. Fans blow. Supporters go. And and that's what I that's what I need is supporters. And so I thank you for supporting me. Thank you for checking me out. And um, stay tuned because I got a lot for you. Know. you. Got a lot for you, definitely. Stay close. You know. Yo, I'm pretty, oh so pretty. So pretty. About to hit the spot, I got my hair and nails diddy. nails diddy. Fresh, filthy, rich model look. Dressed like the kind of stuff you see in the books and magazines. So fresh, so clean. Gotta recognize a diva when she steps on the scene. Everybody looks, looking. dudes and the chicks. No need to play it off, you know you like to take a lick. I'm extra, extra, you can read all about me. Miss Drake is none of what you heard and everything you doubted. Sexy and classy, BX, Chica. When I see a sloppy, I could be your senorita. Miss Drake is real right. Type of body make you do forget his polite. You know I'm bad. Michael Jackson bad. I just broke it down. I'm the best you yeah. ever had. We're gonna pop some bottles. We're gonna pop some bottles. We do it in VIP. Right. So we're the bottles in the VIP. Uh -huh. Put your hands in the air. If you get okay. money, toss it up, toss it up. Pop, pop, pop bottles in the club. Bottles, pop, pop bottles. They ask, who the heck is that when they see how we ride? The suicide doors, Miss Drake is aside. We come through with the bass that shake the damn place. And a little bit of trouble, we not looking for no trouble. I hope the dance floor ready. Miss Drake is not here just to hold the wall steady. All my diamonds, where you at? I need to see you more. And if a glass half empty, what he waiting for? All eyes be on me. When they see how I work, they say, do the damn thing. Make it dudes go berserk. Move my body like a snake. Move it side to side. It's like a work of art. I call it body collage. Whoa. They wasn't ready for this. How I shake it like a pro. Got him clenching they fist. DJ, where you at, son? Play this again. And bartenders give me drinks for all of my friends.